General? This is John Eisenhower. Leonard Johnson. How are you, sir? Fine. I hope you are. Yes, I am. Thank you. Uh, General, I want to visit with you in the next uh, day or so on our problems out in the Southeast Asia. And I, I just wondered if uh, uh, what your schedule was and how that would affect it. I'd like to, I'd like to uh, go over with you and get your advice. Well, of course, I could, uh, I could do anything that kind of uh, uh, I don't want to, I don't want to put it up as like we're in deep trouble because I don't think it, don't think it's reached that point. But I thought this, uh, uh, I don't know whether you have anything you need to do back this way or not. But if you did, uh, in New York or Gettysburg or something, I could have a Jetstar pick you up there any time that suits you. And uh, you could uh, come back here. And then while you're here, uh, I would call you and invite you to come down and uh, counsel with me. I wouldn't, I'm, I'm a little concerned about uh, 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 leaving the appearance that we got an emergency or something. I see. Well, I think I could manufacture something. Have you got anybody in New York you need to talk to at all? Well, I've always got a publisher up there, uh, uh, Mr. President. Why don't you Why don't you go back there whenever you think tomorrow or next day? Let me have my plane pick you up there. I'll send my jet star out there when they're tonight or in the morning, and you go visit him, and then you come on down here and spend a, a day with me at the White House and. Uh, uh, let me say uh, for the public that I understood that you're going to be in New York, and uh, I wanted to advise with you on uh, on the general problems, and uh, I ask you to come down and uh, visit with me so it doesn't look too dramatic that uh, that we got a real emergency. It's not that deep, yes, but uh, it's deep enough that I want to talk to you, yes. and I think it probably you could uh, be more... Uh, uh, comforting to me now than anybody I know. Well, sir, I will, uh, I would think, of course, if they could uh, come out here um, this evening. They can be there any time you say. They, uh, well, I, I mean, for me to take off, they, uh, they could, I think uh, here uh, was the last time I believe it took off. Did I take off the Palm Springs? I guess take off your door off to uh, Palm Springs. If I leave here about, uh, say, 8, your time might be 11. Yeah. I could get to um, probably the easiest thing to do would be to go to Philadelphia and go see my son about something. All right. All right. And uh, that could, well, I wasn't going to know. Maybe be better in New York because that could get some little, if it be noticed. Yeah. And then you could just say that That's you right. would uh, That's right. come down there. That's right. Yeah. What uh, what you do? I'd, I'd come down on that there that afternoon, uh, that evening, right. and then on um, the next morning. Uh, Why don't you come stay all night with me? Well, I put you in Lincoln's bed. <laughs> Lincoln's bed. Well, I think that wouldn't be necessary. They always keep me a place there in the. Morning. Well, no, I, uh, you got. I love you. To, I, I wish you would stay at the White House. I I, I need I need you a little bit. I I, I need a. I need a little Billy Graham these days, and I, I, I need to, somebody to, you know, old Sid's gone, and I called Melton a day or so ago, and he's gone out of the country. Well, yeah, he's, I think he's down in Nassau. He's gone. Uh, Bob, uh, Bob he's gone. He's gone to Everybody's gone except you. Well, uh, by the way, I'll tell you, my, a man that uh, might be a piece, no, he's gone too, I'm going to say Clemson. Gunther is a very smart man. Well, you told me the smartest man in the in the army was good, Pastor. Well, that's right. He's I sent him out there, and I want him here when you come in. I want him to. Uh, matter of fact, I may just send him out there to ride in with you, so he can tell you everything he found out. That'd be a very good thing. He's just he's just back, well, and well, I just think that you got. To, yeah, he could, he could uh, run up to New York. And that's right. That, nice that's 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 a smart thing to do. That's the right thing. Now, uh, if, well, I tell you, then if you will, um, if they will uh, be ready to leave, then they eight tomorrow morning. That's from so, Palm Springs. Yes, yeah, from Palm Springs. Yes. All right, they will now. That would be um, Wednesday. Wednesday would be the day that we could have uh, 
All right. Now, where will you be in New York? Will you likely be at a... you expect to spend tomorrow night there? Well, yes. All right. And, um, yes, because it'll get in. We'll get in there. Will you be at the water? Well, probably. Uh, no, I'll tell you, I'll probably go to the uh, Park Lane. Park Lane. Yes. All right. Well, then I'll ask General Goodpaster to go up there yes. and be at your service whenever you want him. Okay. And then he can come down with you the next morning. All right, thanks. And uh, you bring anybody with you you want to, uh -huh. and uh, if, there's a, uh, if there's any s services you need or anybody you want from any of the departments, uh, they're available to you just uh, well, by... the only thing I could think of, um, if, um, if he's been out there, the best person he would be, would be to talk to him. He just came back, and he went out there because of what you told me yeah. the first week I was in here. You remember when you were over in the building? He's a bad, he's a, he's really, uh, he's a steel trap, man. You told me you thought he's the ablest man in the Army, and so <clears throat> when Bundy started out there, I said, who are you taking? He said, nobody. I said, well, I won't tell you what General Eisenhower told me about good pastor, and you go get him and make him go with you. So I ordered him out there, and he came back, and he knows the whole story from A to Z. Right, well, I'll see him tomorrow evening, and, and, right. and, and we'll come on down the, the next bit more. Right. And you come prepared to stay with me for a day or two. Don't be in a hurry, because I need you. Okay. Thank you, my friend. Thank Give you. my love to Mamie. My love. <laughs> Come